First up, though, everybody, nearly 200 wheels, tires and all stolen from vehicles in a dealership lot. The discovery was made yesterday morning at Matt Hake Ford in Georgetown. KXAN's Angie Bevan is live to show us a bit more about that. Evening, Angie. How are you? Good evening. Well, 48 vehicles are missing all four wheels. Now you can take a look. Some of those SUVs parked in the lot here behind us were some of the vehicles that were hit. Now I talked to a man with the service team here and he says for someone who knows what he or she is doing, it would take about 10 to 15 minutes to remove four wheels from a car. That leads police to think that a group of people was involved. Parked in the back lot, SUV after SUV sitting on wooden blocks, lug nuts still scattered on the pavement. All four wheels on 48 new vehicles at Mack Hike in Georgetown, gone. Police say the stolen car parts are worth more than $100,000. The theft happened sometime between close of business on Saturday and Sunday morning at 8 o'clock. The dealership had no surveillance video to show police, and that's not the only roadblock. They knew what they were doing, so there's not a lot of physical evidence that was found on scene. Um, the fact that it was in somewhat of a secluded, low-lit area is difficult. There wouldn't have been a whole lot of other vehicle traffic or pedestrians in and around that area. With little evidence left behind, police say it's not out of the question that the thief or thieves might have been familiar with the dealership. It would not be far from my mind, so I would imagine that the car dealership is having those same thoughts, and they probably have some internal protocol that they're going through also. I mean, over $100,000 is hard to explain and write off. They have to answer to people as well. Police are asking pawn shops and used tire dealers and businesses like that to be on the lookout for anyone trying to sell a large quantity of tires or wheels. Police also acknowledge that the thieves could be long gone from the area by now. Reporting live in Georgetown, Angie Bevan, KXAN News. Angie, thank you. Rim theft is a huge moneymaker for thieves in Central Texas. It's a crime KXAN Sally Hernandez investigated. She uncovered the new ways Travis County detectives are going after rim thieves, something no other Central Texas law enforcement agency is doing. We've got that story for you online, along with tips on how to protect your car from thieves.